couple of things to notice. I'm in a big marina in Bradenton, Florida on the Gulf Coast, Manatee River. See all these big boats floating in the water except this one. It's on a high and dry cradle or a rack. The reason for that is the pod drives. Pod drives last longer if they are dry stored instead of left in the water. So you can look at these pods, they're pushers, so it might be the Cummins Merc Cruiser Zeus or the ZF brand of pusher pods. Notice there's no rudder on the back of the propeller. And they're dry, so that way you don't have all that barnacle problem on the propellers themselves. Looking in the middle of the propeller, just like an outboard boat, you can see the exhaust is right there in the middle of the propeller. And I can count the aft propeller, the one on my side, has four blades. And the forward propeller on the drive unit side has got five blades. So we've got five plus four blades in contra-rotating orientation. And this is kind of sort of a little bit of a tunnel drive apparatus. Let me move over to the other side of the boat. You can see the other drive pod. That might be a better shot for you. So again, you can see five blades is first, four blades is second. That's the pod. That's a steerable pod known as directed thrust. There are no rudders on these type of systems. So thinking of these systems, the two popular brands that most name recognition would be Volvo IPS or Cummins Mercruiser Zeus or ZF, properly called ZF. If you want to learn more about boats, drive systems, propellers, straight drives, and rudders, look us up. Ask Captain Chris.